about suck, nigga. I'm back to with another freeform dread tutorial. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I got plenty of those already on the channel, so I said I might as well come back with another one next school year. So it's gonna be a junior this year. But I basically just want to make this video because I haven't made a video in a long time, so let's get straight into the video. I wanna hold y'all up no longer. So what the dog do? today's tutorial, I'm gonna be showing how to use the rag method. Huh? This is a white rag, so it's pretty, it's pretty bright because it's fresh and brand new. You feel me? So I got the white rag. You feel me? This is super simple. So if you already know how, know how to do this, this is new information to you. I'm gonna go over it real slowly. You feel me? So you should be able to understand. If you can't, I don't know what to tell you. But basically, so this is like a regular towel. It's a regular towel. It's not microfiber. It's not nothing. It's not nothing special. There's no products involved. Just this and a little bit of olive oil, you feel me? So what you gonna wanna do with this is so wait, let me give y'all steps for what you're gonna wanna do before you use this. So basically before you use this, you're gonna make sure your hair is a decent length. It doesn't have to be long and it doesn't have to be super short. It shouldn't be super duper short. You should at least have like what do you mean by that. Like a solid maybe half inch of hair at least, at least. Like you don't have to have that much. But I'm just saying you probably should. It's probably best if you do it that way. So basically, what you're going to do is you're going to wet up your hair. You're going to rinse it, spray it with spray, whatever you're going to want to do. But it's just make sure it's probably water or either an oily like product. You know what I'm saying? Like something moist. Nothing like, nothing thick because it's just not going to work the same. It might for your hair, but just trust me. Oils are best, especially when you want the skinnier dreads, not the super fat, clumpy ones oils are the way to go and then you're gonna take your rag after you done damage your hair you spray it i'm not gonna wet my hair because it's just not not right now not right. but basically you're just gonna want to wet your hair right you're gonna take the rag and you just like every i've done i've said this like 10 million times in other tutorials and just take it and just like and you just gonna what twist. you're just gonna go over it like this Basically the same way you do a sponge, but you're gonna want to go. It just if you already have started the dreads, then you're gonna want to go in the way you already been doing it. But if you don't, then it really doesn't matter. You could go either way. Just make sure, just make sure, man. just make sure, whatever way you go when you first start, you always go because it will unravel your dreads and make them frizzy. Just no, no. I did that like some years ago, and I thought I was actually doing something because I thought it looked better for the first day I did it. Then the longer I did it, the more it messed up my hair. So yeah, don't just trust me. Just don't do it, bro. Just don't do it. But basically, yeah, like I said, you're gonna get you a microfiber, not microfiber, a normal rag, and you just gonna twist it. But some things, I'm gonna give y'all some tips and things that I found out on my own. Just using a little rag method is you you can either wet the rag to you can wet the rag to get a better grip. You can wet this and your hair, or you can just wet this, or and put oils in your hair. Just like you want your hair to be a little bit wet, or either you can just take this after you wet your hair and just put it in the palm of your hand like this, and just grab it. Like don't grab it super tight, but you want to you want to have a firm grip and do it like that. That's how I started doing it because you lose like you lose grip fast. Like this thing be sliding all through my hand. I could be like this. It don't be working, so you gotta grab it in the middle like this, and just go stupid. You gotta go get me. You feel me? It's mad simple, mad simple. Man, everything that I've said in this video so far also pretty much applies to the sponge. But as I always say, if you have to use a sponge, don't use it when your hair gets long. Switch to rag sponge. Not good for long hair, you feel me? Trust me, trust me. I had long hair doing this one. No, no. You wanna switch to the rag. The rag is the best method. The rag is the best method. Ask anybody who knows, the rag is where it is at. Once your hair is long, no more sponge. Switch. It's not worth it. You'll see, trust me, it's not worth it, bro. Trust me, it's not worth it, bro. Switch to the sponge, bro. It's super simple. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this tutorial. And I just wanna catch y'all up on some stuff. So yes, you might not, or you may or may not 
be able to tell from the room. But we did actually move. I did a whole new, whole new air thing, you feel me? So yeah, that, that's one of the reasons it's been taking me a long time to upload and get everything straight. Cause you know, we didn't have Wi-Fi when we first moved and I didn't have my camera, it was still packed up in boxes and just a lot of stuff happened. And also if you search my YouTube name with the keyword music at the end, it'll show you all the music that I have put out pretty much all while I've been gone away from YouTube. I have been working on music. So if you want to support me and support my music, go stream it on Spotify, it's all on all platforms. So go do that. So like that's pretty much what I've been doing for a for and also been learning, you know, FL Studio from my laptop. And just, you know, I had I no longer have a job, so I just have a lot of free time. And school starting back up, so that's starting to take up some of my time, you know, feel me. But yeah, videos will be coming out soon. Stay tuned, join the squad, join the gang, we up. Rating, oh yeah, oh yeah, rating subscribe PSA, rating subscribers dreads coming out next video or either a couple videos from now. I don't know what I'm gonna drop and I don't know what video I'm gonna record. So send me your pictures in the DMs. Shh. Last time I said that in a video, the video got taken down. So just send me the videos and pictures y'all dread so I can put them in the video. Part two. And if we get enough pictures, I'll just do a part three, like right back to back. You feel me? Back to back bangers. So you feel me? Stay tuned. We up. I'm out. Talk to y'all boys later.